This episode of The Art Assignment is brought to you by Squarespace. Hello, everybody, and happy second birthday to The Art Assignment. Huzzah! <laughs> Happy birthday! Here's to season three! Woohoo! So we're here today to talk about season three of the art assignment starting now. And you're gonna get about one new art assignment a month. So still awesome, wonderful, great artists coming your way with new challenges. But there will also be lots of other ways of looking at contemporary art. Videos about news, more videos that are like the case for, like the case for Mark Rothko or Andy Warhol or Kanye. And we're also gonna be doing more art trip videos where we share with you the art we see and the food we eat when we're in different cities. I love those videos, Sam, because it's always like, look at all the amazing food I'm eating and the wonderful museums I'm visiting while you're home with our kids. Eating Burger King. Mm, yeah, sometimes it's Chipotle, to be fair. And in this next season, we want to answer more of your questions and talk with you directly. Yeah, so to that end, there are three ways that you can get in contact with us and leave us questions that we might use in the show. Here, in YouTube comments, where my pants would be, where I am pointing right now. Also, on Twitter, where we are art assignment, and we have a new Google Voice number, so you can call in and leave a voice message asking your question. And we're still going to be showing off all the great work you guys do through highlights videos and also always on our website and Tumblr. Which reminds me, we have a new website. Yes, it is super awesome and great and a really good way to go back through previous assignments. Yeah, so if you haven't done some of the old art assignments, go to theartassignment.com. It's an amazing, amazing tool for working through an art assignment, for finding other people's responses. I'm just thrilled with it. We're very grateful to our friends at Squarespace for helping out with it. And it's a great tool for students and teachers, whether you're learning about art formally or it's just a passion of yours. Also, John, you may have noticed we have a new set. Yeah, I can't help but notice that this looks kind of like your bookshelves, but it actually isn't your bookshelves. It is created by the artist Nathaniel Russell, who recently did our fake flyer assignment, and it is brilliant. He took my bookcase as a point of departure to create this new one. So we've got Felix Gonzalez Torres' clocks, as mentioned in a previous art assignment video. We have Andy Warhol's Campbell's soup can. We've got the Aquavit from your office. We've got the Pussy Riot balaclava. And I love the book titles. I mean, Swedish things. Here is how I did it. Art cleanse, peace school, video days. Really just like season three, it's all the fun of the old stuff plus lots of new stuff. And finally, we want to say thank you for continuing to make the art assignment possible, for responding to these assignments, for participating in the comments, and for talking with me and with John and with the art assignment community about art today. Yeah, it really means a lot to us. Uh, so many times, I mean, YouTube comments are a joke online, right? I mean, people assume when you talk about YouTube comments, you're talking about a horrible quality of discourse. And here, uh, in the art assignment community, it's very, very different, and we feel lucky and grateful for that. And that is all down to you as people and as artists, the things that you are making and the way that you're able to talk about art without constant invective and screaming at each other. So thank you. Thank you.